I won 100 games in NBA 2K24 my team to find out if I could be rewarded with a free pink diamond Tracy McGrady clone. For all NBA 2K24 grinding, contact Rose NBA, link in description. I am just one triple threat offline win away to get the free pink diamond michael red or reed however it's pronounced i don't actually know i think it's red but we're only one win away guys and we're gonna get him and we're gonna see if he's worth it i'm gonna let you know if he's worth grinding for i'm hoping he's going to be a basically a budget i guess you could say because he's grindable pink diamond tracy mcgrady that's what i'm hoping for is he's just going to be a clone of t-mac but i gotta play this last game right now we're gonna pick him up see if he's worth it and 100 games later, we have the free pink diamond. Guys, comment down below right now, do you have this free pink diamond? And let me know if you think he's good or not. I've heard mixed reviews. Some say he's good, some say he's not that good. Now, like I said, I want him to be a clone of T-Mac. So we're actually going to compare him to my pink diamond T-Mac. Now my T-Mac does have a shoe. He does have some extra Hall of Fame badges, but we're just gonna see. So he's six foot six, so he's not as tall as T-Mac by two inches. The three point shot is a 96 that's so good he's got a 94 mid-range which is still so good driving dunk is an 85 what was the driving driving labs a 91 still really good i don't expect him to be as good as t-mac that's just unrealistic ball handles at an 86 which ain't awful either defense is pretty solid as well in the mid to low 80s he's got a 90 speed 88 speed with ball so nowhere near as quick as t-mac t-mac's got really good speed and when it comes to the badges he should have a lot of good shooting badges and he does he has blinders corner special dead eye green machine limitless see t-mac didn't come with a like, green machine and corner special where this michael this michael card does he's got space creator okay so statistically he does look really good but now i've got to try him out so we're starting off with a game of tr of clutch time online a bit of a budget squad right here honestly um this is my first time ever using this pink diamond michael red so i'm hoping I mean, I've used a lot of T-Mac. If his jump shot's anything like T-Mac, I should somewhat be ready to let it go. Can't seem to find anything yet. Trying to shake this Clyde, who is clamping me up like an absolute pest. I'm gonna have to pass it. I mean, it, it resulted in a bucket, but it was not a comfortable way of scoring. He comes back and he does knock down a three. We're gonna try and shake him. There's a lane right there. We take it inside for an and one. I can definitely notice the speed difference uh, from him and Tracy McGrady. You can notice how quick T-Mac is compared to this card. I can notice that straight away. Our opponent is like really three ball hungry and he's only settling for threes. And I mean, so far it has worked for him. But I hate when as soon as the game seems competitive, they go straight to off ball. We finally got a stop. It has been a little bit tricky to get stops on this guy so far. I have not been able to get room for a three yet with this Michael, but we do keep scoring. It's just inside. We're on the fast break right now. I'm looking for him. I'm still just trying to get that room. Stop right there for the midi. I'm trying to find him for three, but I just can't seem to find it. We got another stop. We're back on the break. Might be our chance at a three. We're pulling it. It's money. I just, it's just kind of a slow jump shot. It's not as quick as T-Mac. The green window is nice though, for sure on this card. Let's go back to him. One thing I think I would do to this card would have to be a diamond shoe with uh, mainly speed inside. Speed and I'd probably just do his three point anyway, but do his speed, speed with ball, acceleration, get those in the plus fours. And I think this card could be looking like T-Mac. We have a three point lead. He's gonna foul and put us on the free throw line. As long as we make our, our free throws, we should be fine. His free throw, I'm sure is good as well. I'm pretty sure it was like low 90s or something like that. It was definitely, it definitely greenable. And we make them both. We absolutely clamp him up and he does not come close to a game winner. I'll take this right here. We just got a free Dikembe Mutombo. Why not, man? I mean, I'm pretty sure his Evo is like an absolute nightmare, but I don't have this card. I now want to make a shoe for Michael and we have this diamond option pack right here. Ball handle, I got 10 picks to pick from. I want some speed things. Is there any speed? Speed, let's go. No speed with ball, which sucks. I'm gonna open up one of these as well. I want, I need a speed with ball. That's what I'm chasing is a speed with ball. I mean, I could give him a gold one, but it just doesn't 
doesn't hit the same. Does this have a speed with the ball? Um, it doesn't, that's so annoying. So we're gonna build this shoe right here. It has a plus four in the three point ball handle, acceleration and speed, and a plus three in the speed with ball. We're gonna apply this shoe to him. Then we're gonna try him out in triple threat online. We've got a solid opponent right here for triple threat online. We're gonna see how good he plays, how good this pink diamond Michael plays now that we got this shoe on him. He should be a decent, decently amount uh, quicker. Our opponent feels good though, so I think I may have to share the rock a little bit. This might be pretty tough. We're gonna grab a screen, we find him, we pull it, it's green. He feels quicker, he feels quicker to shoot his shot. He just feels quicker on and off the ball. Our opponent keeps shooting though. Our opponent is a shooter for sure. Let's find Team Mac. That's a mid range, I'll take it, but that could have been an easy three. We got a stop, which is huge. Can we, he goes straight to the off ball and which is annoying. We're gonna find T-Mac, he doesn't lean. We got him there though, I'll take it. I wanna win this game because our opponent, I think he's just really good. T-Mac's grabbing that screen. Can we free up Michael? Yes we can, let's go, we hit another three with him. Okay, I'm, this, this shoe has made the world of a difference. Oh, what's he doing? He's gone inside with Kobe. He, I thought he was gonna take the three on me honestly, so. Kind of glad, at least, he didn't hit that with me. Now we need to find, we got inside again. Ooh, what am I doing? Grab that rebound, let's go. Back to him, let's chill, let's chill. I'm running out of time, I'm gonna grab a screen, find him. Our opponent is not reading that, let's go. I was short on the release, but that's what the good cards do, they can still make them. I'm gonna go for the screen again. There's no way he falls for it for a third time. Yeah, I didn't think so, but I had to try it. He's just not onballing me, which is frustrating. Got him on a midi. I think it's green. It was green, but it was crazy contested. I'm trying to free up any amount of space for, for and honestly, anyone. I'm just looking to score right now. Find a mark in the corner. Again, doesn't work. Mid-range, bad release. Bad, bad release. That could have been a bucket, honestly. That could have worked for sure. We play good defense and it results in a stop. And it's back to Michael, who's going all the way. Big boy slam. That was huge. We needed that. Our opponent hits us with a bucket as well. T Max taking this up. Where's Red at? Pump fake. He doesn't lean. Mid range. It's good. We have the sharp takeover right now, which may come in handy for our last play. It's going to come down to this last play of the game. I got I to gotta do what's smart. That's what I have to do. I mean, I think he's gonna be expecting me to score with red, and I am. We're shooting it. Oh, we brick it. Oh my God, what a rebound. Chet, go back to him. We just need a little bit of, I'm choking, I'm choking bad. Michael, get up. No. Wow, what a way to end the game right there, and it is 1,000% my fault. I think this card will dominate in offline grinding. I'm definitely gonna use him in offline. Online, he's still really good for sure though, no doubt about it, but he's not on T-Max level, but he's still really good. I definitely recommend grinding for him because why not? He's pretty doable. Pause, but anyway guys, thank you for watching this video. Like, subscribe, I'll catch you in the next upload. It's been witnessed.